Reading chord boxes are easy to understand once it has been properly explained to you and you will be using chord boxes throughout the iJam course so it will help if you get used to them as soon as possible. At the top of the chord box you will see a thick black line, this is the nut on the top of the guitar. The horizontal lines are the frets on the guitar and if there is a number on the left at the side of the fret, for example a 3 or a 5, it means the fret count starts at that fret. The six vertical lines are your strings. From left to right the strings are E, A, D, G, B, E. Imagine turning the chord box 90 degrees and from there think that the top string is the view you would have if you look down at your guitar. The black circles show where you place your fingers for playing the chords. The numbers on the circles state which finger to use. Finally, at the top where the nut lies you will sometimes see a O or an X. The O means strum the open string without any fingers on the string and the X means do not strum the string at all. That's about it for understanding chord boxes, let's proceed to stage one.